So here we are in East Hokkaido, the northeast part of this country. Anyone who's ever come to Japan knows the country is singing to them. In the sounds, melody, jingles, and songs, it's everywhere. And sometimes when you drive Japan's country roads, you see a sign like this. It's not your stereo, it's the pavement and your tires making a song. In this episode, we're going to be showing you how they do this, and more importantly, why. This is the Melody Road Story. This side of Hokkaido is famous for its natural scenery and long roads. Public transportation like trains and buses aren't frequent, so you really need a car in most places here. Driving the east side of Hokkaido is pure freedom. All nature, empty roads. Welcome to the east end of Hokkaido. I'm driving from Sapporo via Kushiro to Nakashibetsu and Shibetsu. It's uh, about a five hour drive through cow country because you can see it and smell it. Uh, this is where Melody Road originates. It was founded here and I'm about to meet the creator, the man who I guess you could say invented the concept of the Melody Road and he's gonna take me to an interesting place in the middle of nowhere, which is just about everywhere around here. The middle of nowhere is actually somewhere. Hokkaido is the northernmost of Japan's four main islands. The biggest cities are in the west, Sapporo, Hakodate, and Asahikawa. On this side, there's Kushiro, Nemuro, and Nakashibetsu. You can see the area is very fertile, with straightaways begging for something unique. Our first destination is just a 10 minute drive away from central Nakashibetsu. All right, I've got my Toyota Rise right here. We're gonna get in the car and drive it down Melody Road. You can see there's nobody around here. This road is pretty empty. There's the Melody Road about 500 meters in this direction. Let's go for a ride. This Czech folk song is beloved in Japan's countryside. Ah, Lovely Meadows is also a Melody Road. Just go straight. You'll have to listen carefully. It's hard to separate the tune from the flowing air. Ah, I can hear it. Ah, oh, that's it. Awesome. Hey, turn around and do it again. <laughs> This is Shizuo Shinoda. He is the inventor of the Melody Road some 40 years ago. He came up with the idea on the job when a bulldozer scraped the roadway and cars going over it made a sound. In 2007, the Hokkaido National Industrial Research Institute helped refine his design. Looking at the pavement, you can clearly see there are grooves spaced out for pauses, but there's more to it than just these grooves, right? So how exactly do these melody roads work? あの、音楽 溝の感覚を決めます。<笑> こういう馬鹿げたことを実際にやるか思っててもなんで東京この道がありません。
Tokyo is the beating pulse of the country, millions of people and cars crossing the city. To also enjoy a melody road? How about here in Shibuya? On the surface, it seems like the perfect place for one. Tokyo is not in the surface, but there are many people who live in the surface. If you build it, you can hear the sound of a car on 365 days. If you hear the sound of a car, you will be able to hear the sound of a car. If you have a lot of people who live in the surface, you can hear the sound of a car on 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 a car. Let's give it one more drive. A melody road adds something unique to driving for just a few seconds, but can't we make a full-length song? まあ、長い音楽難しいですねそうですねでもあの人が聞く分にはだいたい20秒以上作らないと聞いた人は納得してくれないですね currently there are over 30 musical roads around Japan while we drive to another melody road which separates sound by the left and the right tire let me share with you one of my favorites in Fukushima prefecture This is Sasaki-san from Kaneyama Town, Fukushima. He was involved in the construction of this melody road. えっと、2014年、今から8年前にえ、この道路は作りました。で、この辺りで近くの町村でえ、5、6カ所候補地を選定したんですが、その中でもあのメロディーロードなんで音程が変わらないようにきれいな音楽が出るようにえ、カーブ
won't leave Yonago without being reminded of its yokai. We've reached the final Melody Road around Nakashibetsu. Melody Road in stereo. Level up. これ It started off slow. I could feel different vibrations on the left and the right. so cool it you could feel it different the left and the right track it had a different vibration to it just very subtle but the sound it was like in stereo very cool ボギーとてメロディーロードはこう皆さんを楽しくさせれるものだと思ってます。ま、聞いていただいて幸せな気持ちになっていただければ嬉しいと思ってます。I really do think it's something that's unexpected. You're driving along and you hear a melody that might be something nostalgic from the past. Whatever it is, it just brings a smile to your face. And that is a very good thing. So what did you think? Do more places around the world need a melody road? Should they be put into more driving video games? What songs work the best? Leave me a comment below. If you liked it, consider subscribing for more adventures to every corner of Japan. Mata ne!